so in today's video i decided to use the tac v battle rifle we just covered the ftac recon just a few days ago we actually did cover this thing like two to three weeks ago for those of you who've been found the channel for wait what the hell for those of you who've been watching the channel for i don't know i mean just a few weeks at least oh, wait what are you okay you would have known that we already covered the tac v i was literally one of the first people uh, to cover this thing and said it was better than the tac 56 and then out of nowhere i've seen actually a lot of other creators talking about oh man the tac v is this good y'all behind man we've been said it was good but i wanted to revisit it because i had to kind of retune it and make a, a new setup with it because as i've explained it what a beast you can teabag me all you want goodness gracious anyways as i was saying just a few days ago i or not even a few days probably been a, another few weeks uh, the tuning in this game if you fully max it out it actually gives you a lot more cons than it should so you don't want to fully max tune so i kind of want to revisit it and retune uh the tac v because I, I still to this day i still think it's a top tier weapon in this game i mean it is unbelievably good oh my god i mean look at this thing i have a 30 round magazine on these guys are just getting just slammed it's unbelievable it's so so good I mean, I don't even need to sit back. I mean, I'm, I'm going to win every gunfight. It obviously is a little bit slower than the TAC-56, but, I mean, hands down, it is way stronger than it, for sure. So, I'll take it being a little bit slower. But if it's stronger, I mean, by all means, hand it over. I love this thing. I have a 30-round mag. It doesn't even feel like it. It's unbelievable. I just wanted to hop straight into some gameplay. I mean, it's going to speak for itself. I'll show the setup a little bit later, but... Let me show you why you want to see the setup. Don't just take my advice for it. Let's see what we can do. Oh, by the way, I know many asked about the camo I'm using on this thing. <laughs> I mean, I'm using the L.A. Thieves camo, and I have a blueprint on, so it makes it, like, so much more vibrant and brighter rather than just throwing on the regular uh, blueprint on it or just the normal weapon. So you know I'm thinking. Oh, you're such a sly dog. He already knew. T teammate, I'm on a nuke streak. You're here yoinking some kills here, bro. Thank you. Say some for the rest of us. I genuinely don't even see anyone. I think I'm just going to go in there. Look at that, see? It could be slow all, all at once, but when it hits like this, it it like it has the right to be slow. It really does. Okay? We're just going to keep pushing back here. I mean, what are they going to do? Oh my god, they're going to They're just going to accept the punishing. That's what they're going to do. Accept it. Accept the punishing. Accept it. Du Dude. No way. Oh. My goodness. Dude, we didn't even get them a fighting chance. These guys didn't get a fighting chance at all. We got a UAV up. We should be able to get our nuke here. Dude, Tarak? No one told me it was that good of a map. I didn't think it was all that good of a map, but... There's one. Oh, wait. Huh? I already got a nuke. Huh? Uh, the TAC V. It's, it, it's better. It, it, it's hands down better. Like, huh? Are you serious right now? In the comments, let me know. What do you believe is the best battle rifle? Me personally, I think it's this because it's automatic. The rest of the battle rifles in this game, they're not automatic. And I think that's what makes this thing stand out so much. It's unbelievable. Like, huh, dude? If you're not using this, you're doing something wrong. You really are. Should we just continue the streak? Hey, I ain't gonna lie. I, I wasn't too big of a fan of Tarak, but... I'm a Tarak Obama fan. I really am. Oh my goodness. We're all focused on my streak above. Like, it, it, you should be focused on me. I'm the. All right, you got me. By the way, I have been reading a lot of you guys' comments about other unique nukes that I, I was talking about in my Lockman sub video from a few days ago. And, hey, you, you guys got some good ideas. I'm excited to start executing some of them. I already have one recorded. It may or may not be uploaded. I I don't know. It just depends when this video comes out. 
But I'm excited. That's all I'm going to say. So we got a lot of fun, unique nukes. So if you guys haven't subscribed to this YouTube channel yet, first time watching me, I recommend doing so. We're not only doing class setups, we're going to be doing some fun, unique nukes at least once a week. We're going to have one unique nuke going up. And it should be just a, a change of pace. Because, again, all the recommendations of these nukes are going to be from you guys. So all these fun, unique nukes, literally, you guys are... I'm dedicating YouTube videos to you guys from, from the challenge I set out. It should be interesting and a lot of fun. We can still keep going. We have a lot of game time left. I sold. I, I was just missing all my shots. I'm going to see if I can go for like 100 kills. I think that'd be pretty cool. You know, that could also be a challenge. Going for like 100 kills with like a riot shield or something. That would be nuts. No kill streak, just all the riot shield kills. Dude, that's like impossible. I would need the game to last so long. For the meantime, though, I mean, hey, let's just focus up on this game because this could be something really, really good. I don't know. I mean, from everything you've seen, just this game alone. Do you think this is better than the TAC 56? I mean, I don't know. It's got to be like up there, though, for sure, right? They're all back there. Watch my left and right. They're all back here. I know they're. Oh, are you sick? Really, bro? Hashtag sack. Love the name. We're at 61 kills. We definitely have more than enough time to do so. I need to get myself another VTOL ship. If I could do that, it would be nice. I think my favorite thing about this is how it acts more like a, a scar and like TAC-56 than it does a battle rifle. Like, it doesn't feel so super battle rifle-like. All right. Check them out. Check out. We're looking good. I could just sit up here and spawn trap because they're going to be stuck behind me. That's like the key to getting so many more kills. It's just trapping the enemies in the back of their spawn. Uh, he knows where I'm at. I mean, that's fair enough. Fair play. UAV up. All right, let's see where they're at. We're still behind. Obviously, my nuke can win me the game. But also be an honor to win the game. Just because, you know, I'm me and we won. You know, that'd also be great. Look at that. It's just that. Oh, no. I was going to go for the reload. And you can't reload cancel. So I had to pull out my secondary. Come on, dude. Looking good. 71 kills. If I can earn my streaks again, we should be able to get 100. That's kind of the goal here. It's rocking my map, but I'm about to make it my map. Look at that. I, I just challenged the hell out of that. Keep going, too. They're just going to keep spawning back there. I'm just going to nade it. See what happens. Oh, free kill. Nice. They're still spawning back there. Let's go for it. We took these guys out earlier. See, that's the thing, man. When you learn these spawns, you know the behavior of the enemies. I mean, it's it's so much easier. No, he's ghosted. Okay, we're really close to our VTOL ship. We're really going to need it if we want to get a... Yeah, yeah, there we go. They're still spawning back there. Why? See, I didn't think they are going to continue. Okay. A 30-run mag just took out all of them. 30 round magazine did all of that. VTOL, call this in. Boom. They're just going to all die. 82 kills. We're 18 away from 100. Woo! Dude, the TAC V, I'm telling you, rank this thing up. You don't need a TAC 56. They made a. They made the same. They made a TAC 56 2.0. That's what this is. Perfect way to explain it, honestly. I just don't know where anyone's at. I don't want to get sniped because that's all that's been happening to me. That's him, too. All right, let's go ahead and call in our advanced. I'm going to try to slay the hard point here because, you know, it's kind of weird because people be like, Frizz, you don't play objective. And then I win the game. Like, huh? What? I could just slay out if I know we're going to win. If I think I'm going to lose, I play the objective. But I have this nuke. I earned it, right? Oh, my goodness. Now I'm cleaning off the hard point. I'm going to let my teammates play a hill. Like, I don't need to play it. I can slay out. I know my job. I know my, I know my role here on this team. Play out the room. Oh my god. No way. Oh my goodness. Dude. 100 on the dot. 100 on the dot. And we still have two minutes left. No, no, no. This is like encore. No, no, no. I'm not joking. This is encore. You just keep going. You keep going. Oh no. I'm gonna die. Oh shoot. It's all good. It's all good. I can earn my streaks again. I'm actually fine that I died. I want to earn my streaks again. 
I may have been I may have been close to another nuke, but got him. All right, we need to get in there. Dolphin knife. Okay, got him. Got him. Okay, we got UAV too. Oh my goodness! Wait a second. Wait, UAV up. Spawns might be a little sloppy. It's all good. Dude, this is a literal cheat code of a gun. <laughs> I'm, dude, I haven't really died to this often because people just don't use it like that. And they probably don't have it ranked up. Like, it's like the third marksman rifle, like, or sorry, not marksman rifle, battle rifle. Like, who the hell would have this ranked up? It's a, it's a random third one. They got the TAC-56. Why would you want to use this? What? What are they doing? What are they doing besides lining up for Frizzy? Are they back here? Calling the advance. We're still not even winning. I don't even know how many kills we have. I might be able to break my kill record. I gotta get 160 to break my kill record, I believe. If I can get 160, I'm dead again. It's all good. We have the advanced stuff. We have shrieks. That's what we wanted. We're at 117. Do you know how many kills I need in order to break my 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 kill record? I need a lot. I need a lot. I got my eyes locked on the uh, the advanced here because I do have that up. So it's gonna make my life a little easier. I got a bunch of hit markers. Okay. Both are gone. I saw them across the map. Oh my goodness. Oh no, they're all over here. Oh, oh, God, we took him out. We cleared it. Calling the VTOL. Boom. It's on it. Oh, this is getting close. I don't see him anywhere. Nice. Throw that on the hill. Get him off. Nice. Call the UAV. Oh my god. Oh, what? We gotta rotate. There, it's all, it's all the way over there. They're shooting my streaks down again. UAV up. Come on. I dare you. Go for the hill. Go for the hard point. Go ahead. Nice. No shot. This should not be happening. I am playing out of my... We have another one. Boom. Call us in. They think they're going to grab the hard point too. This is the... the I, do you see what happens if the hard point game actually had some length to it? Seriously. I'm in here. No, get him off. Do we get him off or no? Call the nuke. Got it up. Yep, we almost lost. Holy hell. That was close. I don't know how many kills we have. I'll, I'll check out the very... 147! No shot! 147 kills! Give me 150. Bare minimum. Double! That's the 50! Is, that, is it? Is it? Oh my god. I almost broke my kill record. Wait, it's still getting kills. What's going on? It just added another one. I usually do two gameplays, but today I think we only need one. Tack V. A better Tack 56. 152 kills. I was seven kills from tying my personal record. And this is on Tarak of all maps. Here's the setup. After that gameplay, can you guys do me the very least by dropping a like? It takes a second of your guys' time and it really does help push the video and gives us more exposure. And if you guys happen to be brand new around here and you would like to see more crazy gameplays like that, best class setups, tips and tricks, challenges, the store bundles, it's all right here. Hit that subscribe button, ring that bell icon, and you will be notified the next time I upload to keep up with the content. And you can be some of the first people here to see what the new video is all about. Without further ado, let me give you guys my setup. So starting off with the attachments, I have the precision six barrel. You get damage range and bullet velocity. Uh, with this, it just makes your weapon so much more effective at the longer ranges, and you're just gonna get those two to three shot kills so much more consistently. For the muzzle, I have on the Saken Tread 40. This just makes this weapon a laser beam. I think the biggest issue with this thing is the recoil control, and that is completely fixed the second you put this on and tune it, which I'll get into in a little bit. 
Next, I have the F-Tech Ripper uh, 56 underbarrel. Just going back to the accuracy and recoil control. This plus the muzzle. I mean, again, you're not missing any shots whatsoever. I got the 30 round magazine on. 50s OD. You saw I had a 30 round mag in this game in that gameplay, and it's I felt like I never ran out of ammo. I was able to get four, sometimes even five enemies before reloading. It's just that good. So for sure, you do not need 50. It's just gonna slow your weapon down. And then finally, I have the demo clean shot grip rear grip. And this is just to boost up my mobility just a tad bit, just a smidge. You get to sprint to fire speed and ADS speed for the tuning. Starting off with the barrel, we got 0.19 weight for the recoil steadiness. So again, we're just adding on to that recoil control because again, the weapon is very, very sloppy until you tune it. And then uh, at the bottom, we did ADS speed at negative 0.30 because the mobility is a little trash. So we're trying to find that healthy median. For the muzzle, I did plus 0.49 for the recoil stabilization. And then the gun kick control, which is very, very important. At the bottom, we did plus 0.25. If you guys like a number two off, don't trip. Just try to make it as close to this as you possibly can. And your recoil control is going to be phenomenal. For the underbarrel, we did uh, plus 0.59 recoil stabilization. And at the bottom there, we did plus 0.30 aiming at a stability. Look at the accuracy on, on the chart. It is almost fully maxed out. You obviously can't tune the magazine. And then the rear grip, uh, we did negative 0.65 for the ADS speed and then the aiming idle stability at the bottom there is a plus 0.25 tuned to perfection and here's the rest of my setup if you're interested in that I honestly don't know why my screen just all block it is what it is though I'll see you guys in the next couple man tag v try it out for yourselves it is so much fun you guys all stay safe have a great day and I'm out peace